The following is a presentation of our contribution using an illustrative example. Jacquin the Assassin decided to take his workflow to the next level by using formal methods. Hired for a job, he is given n bitcoins as an advance, d days to complete the job, and for its completion he is promised a reward of n bitcoins. At any point, he could do one of the following actions. Either 1. Spend 1 day and 1 bitcoin to look for the target in order to finish the job, where, if successful, he can report to his employers and collect the promised reward, or else, unsuccessful, he'll need to try again the next day. And 2. He can spend half of his remaining money on hiring a subcontractor, where he would start with a quarter of the bitcoins, d days to complete the job, and would be promised a quarter of the bitcoins as a reward. This new contractor would possess the exact same actions as Shaken. Shaken was faced with a dilemma, looking for a very expressive model with good modeling features while keeping significant properties decidable. One of the most well-known models he heard about was Petrinet. While very expressive, it also has multiple important properties which are decidable. However, there are two big limitations. One, its transition rule is additive, and therefore not well suited for a successful tracking action. And two, the static structure of the net makes it harder or even impossible for the management of dynamic objects and recursivity, hence not compatible with the delegation action. Therefore, Petronets were unfitting for his workflow. Fortunately, they possess several extensions that address these limitations. One of this is the affine net a model unifying reset, transferred, and self-modifying net with a concise syntax. This solved his first issue. However, the second action was still out of reach. He recalled hearing about recursive patching nets, which were introduced in order to model distributive planning of multiple agent system where counters and recursivity were necessary which not only were more expressive than Petronet, but also kept imported properties decidable. At first glance, they seem to be promising for action number two, but unfortunately, the initial marking associated with the recursive call only depended on the calling transition and not on the current marking of the caller. In this paper, we define a new extension to both RPNs and affine nets, the dynamic recursive Petronet. We show that not only does this formalism gives us an easy way to model the two actions, but its coverability language is strictly more expressive than the one of recursive patronets while keeping the coverability problem decidable. Hopefully this work will help our friend with his modeling problem while keeping us off his radar.